Welcome back to our channel, folks. Today, we have some thrilling news that has been buzzing around the entertainment world. It seems like Jay-Z, the iconic rapper and music mogul, is allegedly ready to take legal action against the New York Museum. Why? Well, it all revolves around a controversial incident surrounding Beyoncé's country music album Cowboy Carter. Let's dive into the details and uncover the truth behind this intriguing story. Before we get started, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss any exciting news updates. Before we delve into the alleged legal drama, let's first set the stage with a little background. As we all know, Jay-Z and Beyoncé are a power couple in the music industry. They have dominated the charts and captivated audiences worldwide with their talent and charisma. However, their latest endeavor together took a surprising turn. Last year, Beyoncé released her highly anticipated country music album, Cowboy Carter. The album was a departure from her usual R&B and pop sound, showcasing her versatility as an artist. To promote the album, the New York Museum displayed a massive music poster, featuring a stunning portrait of Beyoncé in full country attire. The poster quickly became an attraction, drawing fans and art enthusiasts from all corners of the globe. However, the peaceful coexistence between art and music was about to take an unexpected turn. Rumors started swirling that Jay-Z, Beyoncé's husband and business partner, was furious about the museum's use of the poster without his consent. Allegedly, he felt that the museum was exploiting Beyoncé's image for their own gain, without considering the potential impact on her brand and reputation. Paparazzi cameras captured Jay-Z leaving a restaurant in New York City when a reporter asked him about the incident. Although he remained tight-lipped, his expression spoke volumes, speculation grew, and the media went into a frenzy. Fast forward to the present day and it appears that the story has taken a legal twist. Our sources indicate that Jay-Z has vowed to sue the New York Museum for their alleged unauthorized use of Beyoncé's image. The legal battle that lies ahead promises to be a riveting clash between art, music, and the complexities of intellectual property rights. This case raises fascinating questions about the intersection of art, music, and intellectual property rights. While museums often showcase iconic images to promote their exhibitions, the issue here is whether the museum obtained the necessary permission from the copyright holders, in this case, Jay-Z and Beyoncé. It will be interesting to see how the court weighs the museum's right to display art versus the artist's right to control the use of their image. The New York Museum is committed to celebrating the arts and providing a platform for artists to showcase their work. Our display of Beyoncé's music poster was an homage to her incredible talent and the cultural significance of her Cowboy Carter album. We firmly believe that our actions were within the boundaries of fair use and artistic expression. Jay-Z is deeply invested in protecting the integrity of his and Beyoncé's artistic endeavors. While we respect the museum's dedication to promoting art, we believe that the unauthorized use of Beyoncé's image constitutes a violation of their intellectual property rights. We intend to pursue legal action to rectify the situation. This case highlights the evolving dynamics between art, music, and commerce. In an era where visual representations are crucial to an artist's brand, it's essential to strike a balance between artistic freedom and protecting an artist's image. The outcome of this case could set precedents that shape how artists and museums navigate these complex issues in the future. The outcome of this legal battle could have far-reaching implications for artists, museums, and the entertainment industry as a whole. It raises important questions about ownership, fair use, and the boundaries of artistic expression. The fans are clearly divided, reflecting the complexity of the issue. It's a delicate balance between artistic expression and protecting an artist's rights. And there you have it the court has ruled in favor of the New York Museum. This verdict will undoubtedly have a lasting impact on the relationship between art, music, and intellectual property rights. That wraps up our coverage of Jay-Z's legal battle against the New York Museum. It has been a thrilling journey, exploring the intricate web of art, music, and legal complexities. We hope this case sparks meaningful discussions and prompts artists, museums, and the public to reflect on the boundaries of creativity.